All right, guys, today's video was going to be our power monitor with incorporated data logging to the SD card, but I ran into a problem. 99% done with this and it doesn't want to compile. So that's going away for today. Maybe we'll look at it tomorrow. Instead, this is from Dollar General. This is the Duracell rechargeable, high performance, fast charging USB AC charger, 2.1 amp. And it's basically just, you know, your basic wall charger from Duracell of Bethel, Connecticut, the USA. Of course, it is not made by Duracell. If we can zoom in here. You will see it's actually made by ESI Cases and Associates in New York, who have probably farmed it out to someone in Shenzhen. All right. This was $5 at the Dollar General. Let's see what she says. 2016 Duracell Mini USB AC charger model LE12106. Yeah, 2106. Serial number 6891. Holy shit, it's got a serial number on it. Input 100 volts to 240 volts, 50 to 60 hertz. Output DC 5 volt, 2100 milliamp. Efficiency a level 6? Yeah, and of course made in China so let's find out if it's any good we will bring in some electricity and then we have our Kuisi USB detector and the 3 volt elect or 3 amp electronic load and we'll see just where this thing stacks up. So we'll plug her in and connect the kit up the Kuisi. You guys see that good? Okay. Then we will connect the kit up the load. All right, let's take her up. There's 550 milliamps. And as you can see, we are still getting 5.11 volts. Let's uh, pop out the horrible bright light. How's that? I'm sure we're nice and zoomed in there. All right, let's take her up even further. Take her up to one. There's 1.3, 1 1.2, and kicking 5.27 volts. Uh, yeah, that's pretty impressive. Let's jump up some more. Cranking her up, cranking her up, cranking her up. There, right around two amps, 5.4 volts. I mean, she does seem to be holding. There's 2.1, 2.3, 1.8. Man, that amperage is really jumping around there. But I imagine that has more to do with my electronic load than the output of the power supply. There's the fan just kicked in. 
I'm impressed. Look at that. We're running 2.1, two and a half amps. Up to 2.7 or 2.8. Okay, that's where she shit the bed. Let's take her down. So right around 2.3 amps, she's still good. Let's find her death point. So right around two and a half amps. That's not bad. Not bad at all. So I'm not gonna tear this thing down because uh, my son actually needs it. And I'm frugal, read cheap. So we will do a safety test though and we'll see if there is any continuity between either of the AC input connections and any of the four DC outputs along with the case. So we'll start with that one and we'll check the case, nothing. Then we'll check each pin, nothing. And we'll take the other input and we'll check the case, nothing, in each of the four pins, nothing. So this Duracell mini USB charger LE2106 definitely exceeds its written specifications of 2.1 amps since it is able to output up to 2.4 amps before the voltage takes a dump and it is a completely isolated power supply you can see the pins the input pins are the same shape so it is non-polarized and will go in either way that one's a winner that's a nice power supply for five dollars with the dora cell name on it all right guys if you like this give me a thumbs up i'll see you tomorrow bye